The whole notion of freezing my eggs is actually something that I've had kind of floating in the back of my head for a really long time. I like kind of had an idea of what you did. Like I knew you had to inject yourself. I knew there was like a lot of hormones. I had some people tell me like, oh, you, you barely noticed the hormones. And then I had other people tell me like, oh, I was crazy for two months. So I basically heard like everything on the spectrum. So just focus on these two for now, get to this appointment, and then we'll, we'll tell you how to get two, to the next two, appointment. Two, 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 two. <laughs> Yeah, see what happens. Exactly. Oh you meet with somebody after one of your appointments and they kind of like talk you through it. And that's pretty much it. I mean, you get the hang of it pretty quickly. My whole fridge is like full of this stuff right now. <laughs> They actually mail you like all the shots and medication and the whole the whole shebang. I would tell you what this is, but you know, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce it. They really make it easy. I'm like not even just saying that. <laughs> like once you get the hang of it, it's like bing, bang, boom. This is the first shot and this is kind of like the second shot. So this is where I would like start to do the video. Unfortunately, at the start of my injections, I was by myself, so I kind of had to do it solo. And even for somebody who can like overthink, it was pretty it was pretty easy. And once I got the hang of it, once my girlfriend Megan was back in town, I kind of was like, nah, I don't want you doing it. I can do it. I feel like a doctor. Scrub it up. So the first shot that I'll be doing is the Menopure. And these videos are like amazingly easy. You literally just click that and then it asks you how you're gonna be using it. And we have a lovely Q cap and we do it subcutaneously, which is in your belly. So you click that. Be sure to have all of the following items before you begin. Okay. Using your thumb, flip the protective plastic caps off of the vial of manicure powder and vial of diluent. I'm not scared of needles, so if you are, that could be like a totally different scenario. I've just gotten so many shots because of like my athletic injuries, so I'm really, really used to it. But even for me, it was more like the anxiety and kind of like the buildup of the first shot was actually more like nerve wracking than the actual shot. Because then you do it and you're like, oh, that's it. And then you like do another one, and you're like, oh, I'm a pro. Like <laughs> immediately you feel like very comfortable. Insert the spiked end of the Q cap through the marked center circle of the rubber stopper into the vial. Slightly press on the plunger until a small drop of solution appears I googled at the tip of the if needle. there are some bubbles, you won't die. It's go time. I think like the, am I doing this right? Am I doing this right? Kind of like apprehension is the hardest part of the shot, not the actual. Boop, that part's easy. Everyone that I interacted with at SRM was great. Just like really welcoming, you know, went out of their way to like make sure you were comfortable. Cause let's be honest, you're getting these ultrasounds. So it's like your feet are in some stirrups. Everything's happening down there. For a lot of people that can be like really awkward and they do a really good job of just kind of like making it chill and relaxed. They talk you through everything, every single like poke and prod they warn you about and they kind of give you a heads up. I mean, literal step by step, they're just there to kind of make it relaxing and, and make sure you know what's happening. And she told me to just have you start the Cetratide today. It burns a little bit when you inject it and then it also will form like a red itchy bump um, and that's normal. It'll go away in a few hours. In some weird way, I think when it comes to the actual egg retrieval and how many eggs were they gonna get, I was almost, um, I just kind of detached in a way. I was kind of like, listen, you're 39, they're gonna get what they get. You know, I didn't wanna have like some crazy expectation to be, you know, and then be disappointed.